How was that for a season opener? Oh, that's the fastest one I ever had. So, you know, things are looking pretty good. Training's clearly going well. So, uh, just looking forward to the rest of the season. You know, I love competing and, and being here in uh, Glasgow really is a, a good venue. And I look forward to being here next year for sure. How was preseason? Did you do anything? Did you change anything? Or did you come into it pretty much the same? Just the same. You know, I just went out there. I, I spent more time doing base work. You know, a lot of 300, 400 work and stuff like that. A lot of grass work. But I uh, just wanted to make sure I you know, do a lot of base now. So outdoor season, you know, it's, it's we have world championships. And uh, just so I can be ready for that. What, peak twice this year and obviously to win your trials. And then... Well, you know, I don't really believe in peaking, okay. you know. Because if you try to get ready for one day, you have it. That's one out of 300. 365 days that you might get it right so I'd rather just be ready for the entire season run consistent like I did last year and just win some races and you know hopefully uh, I'll be able to be uh, do well at the US trial so I can make the team in Daegu and, and, and have a good performance out there. Daegu it's gonna be a little bit more difficult than maybe previous years gone by we're expecting that certain China men to to be back in town, are you, are you worried about anybody? Uh, no, nah, not necessarily. You know, I figure if I do my, my, uh, my take care of my lane, you know, I've been doing things pretty well. I've been progressing well. So I figure if I take care of my lane, that I put myself up there with uh, everybody else that's ever been in the event, you know, I feel. So uh, I just kind of worry about doing my thing. And it's, it would be great to, for everybody to be healthy and out there competing because it's definitely going to uh, take a lot. But even in the absence of them last year, you know, I still feel I held the mantle up for the 110 hurdles by having great performances and the fans were talking about us. So that's pretty good too so well when everybody comes back will be the best of being tracking you too. sound like you're really waiting for everybody to come back Darren, Rubles, Lou, yourself I mean, when you get on the line it's like, it could be quite kind of explosive right uh definitely you know but you know it's always when there's so much expectation the hype it, it rarely ever leads up to that so I would rather just come out there we all run well stay healthy and, and whatever happens happens you know we as long as nobody you know gets hurt then that's, that's the name of the game. You know, I'd like to see everybody stay healthy, no matter who you are. You lost weight. Have you lost weight? No, I weigh, man, I actually weigh like 210 pounds, man. This is probably the, is a little bit heavier than I was last year, but then, man, it's indoor season, so by the time yeah. we get outdoors, I'll be right back in that between 205 range. So, you know, but I don't worry about weight. You know, as long as your carry is strong enough to do carry it, then, you know, it's okay. All good, yeah? Yeah. Good luck with you. Appreciate it, man. It's good to see you.